Uh, hello guys, uh, this is War. Uh, today uh, we have exercise uh, uh, to find the value of y. Uh, uh, last time uh, we find the value of x. So today we're going to solve uh, and show you how to find the value of y. Uh, uh, next video we're going to work, uh, this is one equation, but next time we're going to have two equations where we find the value of x and y. So what we have today is 1 over 2y plus 2 equal 10 minus 1 over 2y. So to solve the problem, this one type of the problem, we have to put a number on the right side and then we put y on the left side and then we we divided uh, the number we have of value of y to number we have on the right side. Uh, you can solve the way you want it but it's a good idea to put the numbers on the right side and then uh, the variable on the, on the left side. So let's do it. So what we have here, uh, we have, if we have a minus like you see it here, when we move it to the left side, we say we add. So we're going to add this, we do addition to the both sides of the equation so we can, you know, uh, eliminate the one on the right side. So the, what we're going to do here, we're going to subtract. 2 from the both sides. So we're going to see what number we're going to have. And then we're going to work on y. We're going to move the y on the other side. And because the y is minus, we're going to add on the both side. And the 2, we, we subtract 2 because it's, uh, it's a positive. And that's how it's work. So we change the sign. So if this one was a positive, when we move it to the side, we say, uh, we subtract, we add it. So, uh, let's do it. So, what we're going to do, we're going to move 2. So, we're going to have 1 over 2y. We still have 2 plus 2 minus 2. And we have 10 minus 2 minus 1 over 2y. Because what we're trying to do, we, we're moving these two to the both sides of the equation. So, that's what we, we're just dealing with number two only. So, we, you still have one of the two y, and this one it becomes zero. So, it's going to be, because this one, it goes with this one, you got zero here. And... When you minus this one, you're going to leave with 8. And you still have 1 over 2. Why? So, it should be equal 1 over 2y equal 8 minus 1 over 2y. Because what we've done here, we subtract 2 from, uh, ten, uh, two from 10. You're going to leave with 8. The next step, you're going to add this one to the both side of the equation. Because it's minus here, you're going to add to the both side of the equation. So, it's going to be 1y minus 1y. So this one equal because this one is going to go with this one. And this should be 0. So you can still have 8. And from that so it be So 
because you 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 brought the y from there, so you still have eight. And you're going to take the y outside. So the new equation should be y and should be half plus half. Have eight. When you combine those two, because the new equation should be y two over two equal eight. So you divide this one, one should be one, and y if you want just to show what you're doing, uh, minus eight. So y should be equal eight. And that's your answer. Because what we've done here we divided two to two and that's the answer. So next time we're gonna have two equations. This one is is a one equation uh, to find the value or missing the variable, unknown variable or non value. So next time we're gonna have uh, two equations and what we're gonna do, we're gonna find the value of x and value of y. So it'd be a different, we're gonna combine those two equations and then we can find the missing value. Thank you.